Chris mm -hmm. Ryan. Hey, Kemba, just curious as to how you feel your rhythm is right now. Three games in, you mentioned being pain free was awesome, but uh, what do you what do you sense is where you're at within the flow of the offense? I mean, I mean, it could be better. You know, I would like <laughs> I would like it to be better, but I'm still finding my way. You know, especially with the minutes I'm I'm, I'm having um, and where the games are going. You know. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm still trying to find my way. You know, it'll come. You know, I, I wish I could, you know, I wish I could have, you know, played a little better um, tonight. Gary Washburn. Kimber, do you sense that you guys are kind of um, chemistry-wise, and I know a lot of absences, injuries, just not quite where you need to be, do you, or, are you feel? How do you feel about how you guys are playing? Um, I think we can be better for sure. Uh, you know, we got some work to do. We got some work to do. Uh, you know, we, we just have to be better as a group, executing. Uh, you no know, sharing the basketball, making the right plays, being in the right positions. You know, we're, not, we're just not doing it consistently. And that's what's. That's what's hurting us. John Corrales. Kim, obviously you're on the minutes restriction. There's no Tatum. Robert Williams is coming off of COVID. What do you guys, what do you think you guys can actually take out of these games when you think about long-term and what your playoff goals are? What, what can you take out of these games that applies to that? Nothing. To be honest, nothing. You're not. If we if we if we're gonna play the way we play, we we've been playing. It's just not gonna work. Yeah, it hasn't been good. Man. It just hasn't hasn't been to the level that we know we can play. It. You know, we just gotta be better. That's it. That's it. Yeah. Jared Weiss. Hey, Kemba, uh, you know, when you're defending against this team because of uh, the way the matchups work, you're kind of – you're not usually defending up high on pick and rolls the way you usually do. So especially not being able to have the usual practice time you would get in a normal season, how challenging is it to get on the same page with your defensive role in these kind of matchups? Um, you know, our, our coaching staff, they do a great job, you know, and, you know, letting us on the game plan. I think sometimes we just we don't execute well. You know, that's that's really it. We're just not executing well enough to to get stops. And, you know, in order to win these games, you know, it just has to be it has to be at another level. You know, hopefully we can you know just learn from our mistakes and from here on out, you know, hopefully we can you know get more consistent. Final question for Kemba, Mark D'Amico. Hey, Ken, but Jalen just came out here. Obviously, he tied his career high with 42 points, but he was talking all about, I can do more, I will do more defensively. Um, can you just speak about how, how important is offensive balance to allow a guy like him and Jason to be able to give the effort that they need to defensively to make you guys great at that end? Um, we got we to gotta help him out, you know. It's going to be hard, obviously, for him to do both. At, at a very, very high level. Obviously, tonight he was, he killed it offensively. You know, no, I wish we could have helped him better uh, on the opposite end, on both ends. You know, we, he could have used some help, um, you know, with us making a little bit more shots. Unfortunately, we just, we, we, we missed some some shots that I think, you know, we, we would normally make. Um, but yeah, Jalen, he, he's playing, man. He, he's hooping, you know, on, on both ends. I know he said he can do a little, little bit more, but, it's only but so much he can do, you know. All right, we'll wrap it up right there. Thanks, Kemba. Yeah, thanks.